Good morning everybody and welcome back to my channel. Tomorrow I am flying out to LA and so today it is go time. I have so much stuff to pack and I thought I would do like a packing organization video with you. I have just fake tanned. I hate fake tanning in winter but I'm going to be going from winter to summer so I thought it was appropriate to fake tan. So I've done that. I've just done my makeup. I am now about to go and wash all of my makeup brushes and my sponges so that they have all day to dry so that I can pack them tonight. And I'm so excited, but I have so much to do, so let's get to it. Recently, I've been using the Eco Tools Makeup Brush Shampoo. I actually really like this stuff, and you will see that I am in very much need of some new brushes, so it's on the to get list. See what I was talking about? It just fell apart. And then, like on this one, all of the paint has started to come off. I need to get new brushes so badly, and half of them are really stained as well. This is so bad. I can't believe I let them get this bad. I literally just destroyed this brush. I'm gonna have to go and take another powder brush with me now. Look at that. It just like completely fell out. I've had these brushes for over a year, but yeah, I didn't realize how bad they were. That's it. I'm buying new brushes when I'm on my holiday. Alright, makeup brushes are done. I tried very hard to keep the water to only my hands because when I'm fake tanned, I like to leave the tan on my hands for a little while, maybe half an hour, an hour, and then I will actually wash it off because that's when my hands go really, really dark. So right now, they're a little bit lighter than my body because I just washed it all off, but as I like go through the day touching myself and like still having fake tan on me, they're going to get so dark. So I did pretty well. I got a little bit of a splash up my arm, but I did really well trying to keep the tan like all together and not get my hands or my arms too wet. Um, I've just grabbed out my suitcases and I'm starting to feel that overwhelmed. Like I don't know where to start because I've got to pack like summer stuff more so than winter. So this is going to be really tricky. I've got to go into like my summer wardrobe and try and find some things that I can get. I'm also going to buy stuff while I'm there, but um, yeah, I've got to go kind of out of season right now. These here are my two suitcases. The large black one is my checked luggage and it's from American Tourister. And then I have a small white one, which is my carry-on luggage. And that's from Flylight. I both, I got both of these bags from Strand Bags and I love the combo just being black and white. And then I have like pink little tags to know that they're mine. So I'm not going to take as much as what I normally would because I have to dig in to my summer clothes and I don't really have a lot of them. So I might just buy some clothes over there and then when I get back I can just save them and wear them when it turns summer here. I'm just taking a snack slash lunch break. I got a pizza because I'm hungry. Um, I had an Uber Eats voucher so I decided to get all of this. I am in the process of getting a video exported on this computer and it just died. So now I've got to plug it back in. And hopefully all the footage is still there and it's still good. I got this little guy here chilling out. That's all my giveaway stuff. Over here, I have an entire collection of to-do lists of each video that I've got to get finished. And I'm just finishing up my bullet journal video. I have a big fat reminder to send Jess from Study With Jess the G7X charger. I lost my G7X, she lost her charger, so I'm going to give her charger like to her, I'm gonna give her my charger this afternoon when I go and see her, when I go and drop this guy off at my brother's. So I've been getting his food and his stuff together. I've been packing. Oh my gosh, so much is happening, but oh no. Uh oh. Look at that. <laughs> Please tell me this is not a complete disaster and all the work that I just did is. Oh man. Uh oh. This could be bad. My computer's been messing up for like the last half an hour. Okay, hopefully this doesn't take too long and it's an easy fix. I've washed up all of his bowls. I've got to like put them in a bag. I've got all his favorite toys and some of his cat food. I need to get him some more though. So my brother doesn't live too far away from a supermarket. So once I drop him off, I'll duck in and get that. I just got to go put his kitty litter and all of his belongings in the car and then not forget the charger for Jess and then we're going to head off. So, 
Kat is dropped off. I have dropped the charger off at Jess's house and there are some really sinister storm clouds rolling in. It looks like it's going, I'm pretty sure I saw lightning too, not the uh, lightning before as well. So it's probably gonna be quite a stormy night. I have to head home now and finish packing and then I get to leave, which I'm so excited about. So yay, the sooner I get home, the sooner I can get packed and the sooner the stress of everything because it took me so long to get to my brother's house can go away. This has been a lot longer of a trip just to drop my cat off than I thought, but it's all right. We're gonna keep going and we're gonna get everything done and it'll be okay. I've come home and gotten straight into packing. Um, I have a little pile of stuff that I'm gonna be wearing on the plane. I've actually got one dress. I realized I don't own that much summer clothes, so I'll probably do a fair bit of shopping while I'm over there. I've only got three like tops. Um, I might scrub some t-shirts actually. I have a denim jacket. I have two pairs of shorts, the only two pairs of shorts I own. Three pairs of jeans, because I did check the weather and I think I'll be able to wear some jeans. A giant pile of underwear. One bra so far, I'll probably need another one. I've got some singlets, some swimwear, some gym clothes, a few pairs of ankle socks, and of course I've got some pajamas, and then I've started to dig out my electronics and all of my bits and pieces that I need to take. I also, when I opened my suitcase, found these like shoe bags that I got when I was in Japan when I bought new shoes, so I'm gonna put my shoes that I'm taking with me in there, which is awesome. I knew I kept those for a reason. I've also like started to collect all of my toiletries and I went down and I picked up some sandwich bags because I like them, or not sandwich bags, Ziploc bags, one in sandwich size and one in the large because I really like them for storing all of my toiletries and all my electronics. I just like to travel using Ziploc bags rather than actually buying bags. I've managed to extend on everything I need to pack. I think I have everything out now. I've just got to go ahead and start putting it into the suitcases. I'm only taking four pairs of shoes. I'm taking like gym sneakers, which I'll wear there. I've got these more casual ones that I think look great with like shorts or dresses that you can wear them with anything. I'll have one pair of high heels and then I'll have another pair of sandals. And then in terms of other summer shoes, I might just look at maybe buying something while I'm there. I've managed to add more things to the collection. I'm pretty sure I have all of my essentials now. Everything is all sorted. I think all I have to do now is pack everything up, which is gonna be so nice to get all of this into the suitcases. All of my toiletries and essentials are all packed up, ready to go. Also adding a scarf because I find planes really really cold and even though I'm going into like summer I just I need a scarf to kind of get me through also I'm really bad and don't own a laptop case so I just can wrap my laptop inside my scarf honestly I stick it in that side the zip side by itself I can also fit my neck pillow in here I have no idea what is on my neck pillow there's these weird marks um, and then that's pretty much it everything else goes into my handbag and so I'm really packing quite light the um, electronics and the laptop literally just on their own put me usually over the like cabin limit which is very annoying I get away with it most of the time but there have been a few times I've had to pay so I try and keep this pretty minimal but it's an easy way for me to lug around such heavy items on wheels through the airport so that I can still work while I wait for my planes and my flights and whatnot so yeah, let's zip these up and get out of here. So the last few things I have are, I got out my Gucci little handbag because it's got a zip pocket to the top of it, so I think it's really good. And it's little, I don't like lugging around massive handbags. I have like my essentials purse that has like all of my girly goodness in it. I also have my wallet with all of my life in it. I have my sunglasses. I also have headphones and then I also have like a, a cleaning cloth for my lens, camera lens and my glasses if I need to as well. And then I also have my watch, which I can't go anywhere without a watch, so I like to take this silver one. And then that's that, everything is done. Everything is all packed and ready to go. So I am finally finished packing. It feels so good to have everything in the suitcases. I 
stink like fake tan and I feel disgusting. So I'm gonna go and quickly rinse everything off from here down. And then I'm out of here. I am so excited. I'm leaving tomorrow morning. I'm not staying here tonight. Um, so I'm just gonna, you know, get changed into what I'll be wearing tomorrow morning because I'll only be wearing it for maybe an hour or so tonight, which is totally fine. But I'm so excited that it's all done and I finished all the videos and I finished everything that I needed to do. So I need to take out the rubbish and then have a quick shower and then I'm out of here. So I really hope you guys did enjoy this kind of like packing with me, showing you how I organized my like, I have just showered, seriously, my camera cut out just as I was trying to do the outro before. My face is so shiny. Um, I kind of remember what I said. Basically, I just took out um, the rubbish. I have just showered. I have cleaned up a few things and I'm about to head off and I'm so excited. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed this video. And up the top here, you can check out my last video. Down the bottom, I will leave a link to another one of my videos. I don't know which one. It'll just be a video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.